This video focuses on entering the input data needed to run the steel design according to the AISC 360 and R 6 Now that we have completed modeling and loading the structural model and have entered the effective lengths done in the previous video, we can explore the relevant design situations for steel design and create our own design configurations. To gain a better overview of the individual design situation types, Jump to the steel design table and select the input data from the subcategory. In this table, you can find all the design situations used for steel design. RFM automatically assigns the correct design type to each situation. The second tab displays elements that were automatically selected based on their assigned materials and sections. Individual components can be excluded from the design if desired as well as the design all checkbox can be unchecked and individual elements can be selected for design. As you can see, we already have our four internal beams selected. We can also click on the cell here and the select member and graphics button will pop up and we can select our other four columns. The tabs for materials and sections show relevant data for steel design, which we can skip if not needed. In the following tabs, we encounter another innervation, which is the R from 6 design configurations. Now you can assign ultimate and serviceability configurations or both to specific structural components without creating a new design situation. To do this, all you need to do is edit the desired members and go to the Design Configurations tab. Here is where you can create a new ultimate configuration. And then we can simply confirm the dialog box to create the new configuration. Now you will see this in the tables. You can find and manage the configurations in the members tab. And then you can also see which members this configuration is assigned to. This concludes our exploration of design situations and design configurations. In the next video, we will run the design calculation and dive into the results. Until next time.